Right, what we got in here is a Jaguar XJR supercharged 4 litre. Um, the car came in, actually, I bought it last year with a blown up head gasket. As I had a spare engine of a 2001, I always had an idea of changing the engine over from the car that broke with space and fitting it into this car. Well, the problem is that this particular car, it is a 98 registered and it's got an engine code of AJ26. And I have an engine code which is AJ27. Therefore, engine is not just a um, straight swap. I, I encountered a few difficulties and I'll just show you now what they are. So basically this is my Jaguar which I'm rebuilding in my own time. So now this is the engine that I got for the vehicle, obviously. Um, the first thing, I didn't know that the engine would not fit straight into the car without um, changing a few bits on it. As I said, being an AJ27, first of all, there's an extra sensor in here for an oil temperature. Then uh, we got different flywheel, which this is the flywheel which I took off the AJ27. And then I had to fit the AJ26 flywheel in here. Um, the car has got different timing as well. Different ignition coils. At the same time, this being a 93,000 miles engine, I had to check the cam tensioners, which have uh, been changed and chains. Obviously, I had to obtain the locking tool um, kit for the camshafts. So basically, one goes on this side, one goes on that side. Then um, one fits right at the back of the engine in here, which goes into the back of the sump if you can see it it's actually here now well it's behind the sump goes into a flywheel anyway never mind now the problem is this aj27 has got two crank camshaft position sensors one's on this side and one's on this side the aj26 engine has got only one camshaft position sensor which comes onto this side of the engine so basically it's apparently a bank b so when you're standing in front of the engine it's on your right side so therefore i had to change the camshafts from one engine to the end to the other so basically this is the camshaft of an aj26 which times the camshafts and this is the camshaft of a aj26 which i will remove out and it only has basically one um, it's called a camshaft sensor trigger all right so there's basically one of these in here and there are two in here three so basically that is the whole difference out of it now, the chains are very good on this engine, as you can see. I have a receipt that someone changed them about 10,000 miles ago, which are actually a metal ones. Um, I will have to shim the engine. Um, the clearance on the inlet, it is 